As the hot weather continues, extra checks are being made on the elderly and the vulnerable. You've got the fresh air on, I see. Mark is a sheltered housing officer in Southwark in London. He's making sure Steve is following the advice that he's been given. The NHS warns that although most of us welcome hot weather, when it's too hot for too long, there are health risks. The soaring temperature has put pressure on some emergency services. We are seeing a 30% increase in ambulance calls for emergencies on some of the recent hot days. So it's not scaremongering. People are actually getting unwell in the heat. Attempts to cool down have led to tragic consequences. At least four people have drowned while swimming in open water this week. Two, including a 16-year-old boy, died at this flooded quarry in Norfolk. Some reservoirs, like this one in Wales, are taking additional safety measures to stop people swimming in them. We've actually employed an extra security cover at the moment to cover sites in conjunction with our range of staff. But the numbers of people coming out are just overwhelming us at the moment. And it, it is a significant problem. And we do really need to get the message out that reservoirs are not safe to, to swimming. For most, it's business as usual, no matter how hot it is. But the advice is to try and stay cool, hydrated, and look out for those most vulnerable. Alexandra McKenzie, BBC News.